Stan Gibalisco here, uh, passing by the planet Jupiter on my way back to Earth from my vacation spot on one of the moons of Saturn. Uh, I'll be home uh, shortly because this is a high-speed spaceship, but it uses a lot of components like this in its electronics repertoire of circuitry. An opto-isolator. An opto-isolator, which is actually a method of coupling an, one circuit to another without any electronic interaction between them. For example, an oscillator might be here, an amplifier here, or we might have uh, oh any number of different things. An input uh, might be a weak signal amplifier going to a stronger amplifier. Uh, and or any kind of situation where you do not want the mutual circuits to interact with each other electronically. You want to maintain complete electronic isolation between them. And the way that works is to use something called an opto-isolator or optical coupler. The input goes to a light-emitting diode or infrared-emitting diode. The... Uh, Infrared or visible light passes through a clear barrier to a photodiode or photosensitive diode, which is biased in such a way as to create another electronic signal here, which can then go to the next amplifier. That way, the impedance of this second amplifier, the input impedance, will have no effect on the behavior of the input amplifier and vice versa. Any change in the output impedance of this amplifier over here, the input amplifier will not in any way electronically affect the behavior of the second amplifier because there is no electronic connection between these things. Now optical isolators look a little bit like integrated circuits. They have an opaque enclosure uh, but the interior is transparent to allow the uh, infrared or visible light to pass from the light emitting diode or infrared emitting diode to the photodiode. It's uh, optical communications over a very short distance in a way. I've done op optical communications by the way it's it's really cool. So this is the opaque enclosure here it's not necessarily shaped like that and the transparent interior. An opto-isolator, also known as an optical coupler, uh, that's a very basic component that any electronics experimenter uh, should learn about if they don't already know about it. Stan Gibalisco, signing off for now, still moving along by Jupiter. Until next time, so long.